Hello everyone and welcome back to The Walking Dead 400 Days. In the um, previous video guys, we made it through Vinch's story or episode. And we are going to, I guess, go to this girl, Cell. I can't say these two people's names. Wow. But you, you know how to say it, Cell. That's all I can, oh my goodness, whatever. But <laughs> thank you guys for all the support you've shown on um, episode one, guys. It was very much appreciated, so um, let's continue this awesome game of awesomeness. Here we go. Now, what's going to happen with her story? I don't know. Something. We're just jamming out on this guitar that looks like it's been beat up. People smiling. Ah, oh, so happy. So, 236 days. Sister's getting pretty good, huh? Becca had a good Sale. I was right, Sale. Okay, never mind. Thank you for doing that. She needs something to focus on besides, you know, everything else. Yeah. Growing up in a world like this, what do you think that does to a kid? She's already changing. She dismisses things she cares about so easily. I guess you kind of have to when you've already lost so much, but I still worry. Becca's a good kid. These are shit times, and she's going to go through that. But if we can keep her from experiencing some of the shit I've seen... Thanks, Stephanie. Thanks. Good job. I whistled, guys. I hope that wasn't too loud for you. <laughs> Thanks, sis. You think we can do something like this every week? That sounds like a great idea. Maybe we can all get in on it, like some kind of weekly talent show. That was amazing, Becca. We could all use a little more music in our lives. Did I ever tell you that I used to play in a band? Yes, Roman. You've told us. She doesn't want to hear about it again. All right, all right. In that case, let's get back to work. Oh, and thanks to Boyd's hard work on the vegetable garden, we're having fresh soup tonight. Okay, let's get to it. You want to help me and Shell do the fresh stuff? soup! Cool. You check the flashlights this time. I'll look over the guns. Cool. Actually, I wanted cool. to make sure our blades were in good condition first. No rush on the flashlights. Shell, when you get a sec, meet me out back. Help me feed the watchdogs. Sure thing. Alright. Alright, guys. Awesome. So let's, um, we're playing a Shell. So I was right. <laughs> I thought I was messing the name up, so I was right. It was, it's Shell. How are we this? doing on ammo? Uh, I'm going to talk to everyone first. We haven't had to use these for a while. That's good. Well, what do we have anyways? We got some guns. Not a lot. Where's the ammo? All I see what is guns. <laughs> Not there should be ammo boxes. Find out? Yeah, in a sec. Oh my goodness. She just... Wow, oh, okay, whatever. Still flashlight. How the flashlights look? We never found the other flashlight? Nope. Still in the cornfield somewhere, I guess. You guys need help? I'm not walking nah, into no cornfield. Right, Becca? You go ahead okay. and help Roman out back. Okay, I'm gonna go help Dino Roman. Pretty nice What's this? Then. Look at photo? That's because they used to pay people to clean it. Also, not as many dead visitors back then. Ha! Ah, oh, you people are so funny. It's like comedians. Comedians! You live with them every day. What is that? Empty wall? I'm not gonna walk back or to the empty wall. No. Um, I wanna hey, look Becca, in here, but I, I wanna we look start charging for the other places. We make. Oh yeah, then we can spend all our money at nowhere. Ah, uh, these, these people are so funny. I'm, <laughs> I'm laughing. You don't, you don't understand it, but I'm laughing. Oh, these knives nice. are looking pretty ragged. Don't worry, they're on our list. I said I was gonna clean them. I was just looking at them. Hey, these these knives are here. Oh wait, blood stain. Oh, never mind. I don't want to look at the blood stain. I'm just gonna feed the watchdogs and be awesome about it. Let's go clean these watchdogs. Waha! Exit. Oh, I miss this God, game so I much, guys. For a cup of coffee look at the morning. coffee machine. Oh, a cup of coffee in the a... <laughs> cup of coffee in the morning, guys. Oh, that'd be awesome. Soda machine. What's this? 
on well, what if the soda's still in it? You know, this stuff should work, you know, if they actually just kept power wait, soup? Smells good. Yeah, give me some of that soup. I'm gonna taste it now. I'm not gonna taste it, I'm just gonna stir it. That's soup wasted. You didn't you didn't know you never know that? I'm not gonna look at these other things. I'm gonna go out of here. That's soup wasted. You just wasted soup by stirring and getting it on the spoon, and then just setting it off to the side. You should lick the spoon and oh, you scared me. He's hungry. Oh guess he knows it's feeding time. Disgusting. Can't disagree with you there. You know, uh, your sister said she wouldn't mind doing this. Roman, we've talked about this. Becca doesn't need to deal with this kind of thing. Listen, I know you think that giving her an easy life is what's best, but it's really not. It's better than the alternative. I'd rather she have a shorter, happy experience in this world than one full of fear and death and horror. As long as she knows how to protect herself, it's fine. I don't want her to stop caring about people. Okay. What's that one eating? I don't know. I'll check it out. I gotta get back out front. Looking forward to that soup. So I don't want to get near to this, so wait. I'm gonna talk to it? I'm gonna talk to the walker! Aww. Aww, I'm disappointed. I wanted to talk to it. So, how was your day, Mr. Walker? Walker, Texas Ranger. <gasps> it's a Texas Ranger. He's. Oh my goodness, look at him, guys. He even has a suit on. Oh my goodness, he's so cool looking. Uh, I always want to know what he looks like up close. So, this is actually a smart idea. This is what they took out of the TV series. Having him chained up. Oh, it was better if they actually learned from it. Oh, what is it, anyways? <sighs> What is he eating? Ugh. Oh, dog. Oh, dog. Never mind. Just a dog. Eh. Eh. I checked what she was eating. It was amazing. She just looked at me. That walker just looked at me like, What you looking at? What you looking at? <laughs> okay, let's go back inside. So I guess I hope that wasn't like a pet dog or nothing. I bet that was um her sister's dog, and it just ate. Oh my god, that'd be so sad. Ugh. Oh Jesus! Don't ever fucking do that again. Whoa! What's your problem? I do this all the time. You don't get all pissed off. I'm sorry. It's it's just the watchdogs. I guess they found a a puppy. A puppy? Yeah. I guess it just got to me. You know, it was it was so little. You don't think about babies anymore, but after a while you just kind of accept this is it. Yeah. I guess you kind of forget. <laughs> right. But then, you know, there it is. If you see it and you want to protect it and... That sucks. Maybe if Clive dies next, we can put him out there instead. He'd make a better watchdog anyway. Becca. Shell! Becca! Something's going on outside! What is it? I don't know. Something bad. We gotta find Roman. What's going on, guys? Oh my goodness. Oh, that was a poor puppy. Oh, man. I'm sad now. Wow. Come here! Everyone! Shit! Come on, we gotta find Roman! Yes, Mom. It's okay to be there. Jesus! Largum. My God! Largum. What did you do? All I did was put on the blindfold and bind his wrists. Somebody else beat him up. He already had the cuts and bruises. Watchdogs caught him trying to steal supplies. Is he bitten? No, they didn't get that close. Did he hurt anyone? No, thank God. Who is he? I don't know. And I don't think he speaks English. I can't believe he just snuck in. Second break-in we've had in the last couple of weeks. 
Last time we couldn't catch them. And they got away with more medicine than we could afford to lose. Well, we all know what it's like trying to survive out there. He just came in here for food. Let's just give him some and send him but on his what way. What if there are more of them? He could have been scouting. That's right. He could be part of a larger if group. If there were more, I think we would have seen them by now. I mean, nobody travels alone by choice anymore, right? Boyd's right. We should just let him go. Why? Look at the poor bastard. We've all done the same thing trying to survive. We don't have to be responsible for him, but we can give him some food and let him take his own it's chances. It's not about his chances. It's about ours. What's to stop him from coming back? And armed next time. We could always use more hands keeping the place secure. Boyd, we don't need any more people here. And look at him. How is he he gonna... can't even speak English. This group uh, works because we know how to communicate. My goodness. We can find a way for him to help. Well, he's not staying here. You let in a stranger, and everything starts breaking down. The last time we did that, we lost Bree. And then Vernon with that goddamn boat. Vernon and the boat are the reason the group fell apart. Wait a minute. Not trusting strangers. Vernon was out for the boat the whole time. And the second they left that boat unattended, we just stole it. That's when our group fell apart. He can't stay here. Wait a minute. Are these the people? They are. Keeping him here is not an option. In his condition, he'd be a drain on our resources. <sighs> Oh my, these are we the people. We know what we're talking about here, so let's stop dancing around it. We either let this guy go and take our chances, or we kill him. Jesus Christ. Are you serious? Roman's right. It's gotta be one or the other. We're letting him go. It's the only right thing to do. I'm telling you, we can't do that. But killing him? Is that really the answer? <laughs> Stephanie, Boyd, you two don't think we should kill him. We know where Joyce and Clive stand on the subject. You're the swing boat here, Shell. What's it gonna be? I already decided I want to set him free. We have to set him free. We can't. He's not even armed. We can't just kill him. This isn't in self-defense. Isn't it, though? If it means he can't come back to hurt us? That isn't the same thing. But last time... Joyce, that was a long time ago. If we kill this man, then we're giving up a part of ourselves that we can never get back. I guess he's gonna kill him. I'm not ready to let that go. <clears throat> Cut him free. I hope you guys know what you're doing. Oh, what do Give him some food. When, three or four cans. Just as a gesture of good faith. Get him out of here. I don't know if you can understand a word I'm saying. But you better understand this. You came this close to death today. And if you ever, ever come near this place again. Or tell anybody where we are. You wish you had died today. What was that? Oh, smiley face. Oh man. 259 days in. But oh, these guys was the people from the first episode. Do you have any fours? I'll, say, I'll tell you in a minute. Nope. Do you have any sevens? Oh, exciting. Um. Yep. Yep. I miss playing guitar for everyone. I mean, it was stupid, playing the game. But awesome. Fun. Five. Here's the five. Why don't we do that anymore? Since the attack, there's a lot we don't do anymore. I shouldn't have let that guy go. Oh, I don't have a five. Still be alive, and everything would be the same. Boyd agreed it was the right thing to do. Anyway, Roman's obsessed with keeping this place secured now. Wait a minute. You know that's impossible, right? Well. After last time, Roman isn't taking any chances. Then he should fix the loose board behind the storage lots. Becca, are you sneaking out again? Oh, God, do you know how dangerous that is? It's not dangerous. 
There's nothing out there but slow-ass walkers. What are you talking about? We've had two break-ins already. Anyone could be out there. What if someone sees you and, and follows you back here? They won't. Damn it, Becca. Shell, I need to talk to you. It's open. What's going on? Hey, Becca. Hey. When you uh, get a sec, I need you to come out and talk to me. It's important. Okay. I'll be outside. You'll see me. Give us a minute. Yeah. Just don't take too long. I won't. What was that all about? <clears throat> Probably nothing. Don't worry about it. He said it was important. Yeah, well, these days everything's important to Roman. Stay here. It'll be just a minute. I'll fill you in when I get back. But these guys was the people from the first game that took our boat that had um that were sick and they took it so I guess Vernon's dead finally and that other person's probably dead. So I'm happy now because that guy was like the biggest idiot ever and he took our boat and it was just horrible and oh my goodness, but he's dead. Awesome. I'm happy now. Boyd's painting. Wait, did Boyd die? Wait a minute, did he die? Wait, did he come back and kill? Did I just make a mistake of not killing him? I should have just killed him. Wow, what did I do? Oh my goodness, did I make Joyce, a mistake again? Joyce, do you again? know what's going on? I don't know if I should say anything. Please, what is it? They caught Stephanie stealing, and then trying to escape. Oh my God! What are they gonna do? I don't know. What can we do? I'll go talk to Roman. We'll figure it out. Oh my goodness. She, oh, someone stole something from us. Oh, that other person, that one girl. Oh my goodness. Roman? Good, you're here. I heard about Stephanie. I'm sorry. What are you gonna do? You know what we do. What happened? We caught her trying to escape. Maybe she wasn't. Maybe she just wanted to get outside these walls for a while. Ever since the incident, you've made this place feel, I don't know, oppressive? We've made it safe. She was definitely trying to escape. She had most of our ammo and medicine with her. She screwed us, Shell. All of us. And now we're in that position again where we can't keep her here and we can't let her go. You do know why I'm telling you this, right? Yeah. You want me to take care of it. You and Boyd were the ones who fought to let that guy go. Convinced us all to take that chance. Well, we did. And it was wrong. And now Boyd is dead. We're beyond... Oh, oh sorry guys. ...the luxury of taking chances now. And I need to know that you're with us 100%. Oh, I made a mistake. Wow. Oh, man. You Oh, come on. Let's talk to her first. See if we can talk some sense into her. No. She tried to sneak out and leave us without any medicine or extra ammo. She knew that could mean the death of any one of us. If we give her a second chance, she might not okay, try yeah, to Okay, yeah, I'm so just going to kill her. That's what it's going to look like. That's just what it is, guys. I'm going to have to kill her. It's in the camper. I'll give you a few minutes to get your head together. God, what do I tell Becca? That's up to you. Whatever you say, I'll back you up. Shell? What's wrong? Am I in trouble? I'm just gonna be honest. It's Stephanie. She stole a bunch of supplies and tried to escape. Oh my god. What the hell did she do that for? Roman says we have to... Kill her? Yeah. Why would she do this to us? Doesn't matter. She did what she did. Stupid. 
Roman wants me to do it. I'm sorry. Let's just get it over with. Your gun's over there in the drawer. Oh man, guys, we're gonna go do it. One thing about this game, it is pretty deep. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. Man, two deep games in a row, guys. First, The Last of Us. To be who oh, we are. Walking Dead, man. Just let me do it then. No, I'll do it. I'll do it. You shouldn't ever have to do something like this. I just need a second. This really sucks. Yeah, it does. It does, really. You know, we don't have to do this. We can just go. What? We've survived on our own before. If we just go, we can be out of here before anyone can do anything about it. Are you crazy? Where would we go? There's nothing out there. As long as we're here, we're safe. The group will protect us. But for how long? I don't know. Longer than we'd survive out there. Besides, you know the rules. If we try to leave, Roman will hunt us down. We don't have a choice. This is who we are now. That was like the biggest, um, or the worst decision. I mean, leave? Wow. Leave walls, leave guns, leave food. Why not? <laughs> I don't ever want to put you in danger. If that means this is what we have to become, then it is what it is. I'm not going to leave this safe place. I mean, why, why is he worrying about so much of what she does? I mean... Let her grow up. That's like my opinion on the matter. I'm sorry. Me too. I mean, my goodness. <laughs> wow. Is that episode two? That was episode two, guys. Wait, who who's taking these pictures off? Wait a minute. Who is taking these pictures off? Uh, it might be familiar, guys. Oh, wait. Someone is taking these pictures off, and I guess once we get everyone down, it's going to be like this, um, like a main character. I don't know. I can't wait. Okay, guys. Well, I hope everyone enjoyed, um, sales camp or sales episode, um, if you did, don't forget to leave a like down below, guys. Favorite the video, comment, ask me questions, all that awesome stuff, guys. And don't forget, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. And as always, this has been 2 by 2 gaming and take care.